<laughs> Hello everyone, how is everyone doing? It is Mesh Yourself here. Today, we are playing 60 Seconds. Now, 60 Seconds is a game I haven't actually played before. I think I tried it out once. All right, it is basically a game where you have 60 seconds to grab anything that you can that can help you uh, uh, survive in a bunker and you need to, you know, save your family and keep them surviving and stuff. You'll see, guys. All right, we're gonna do the apocalypse, guys. The apocalypse is happening. Oh my goodness, what's happening? So we're gonna play as my dad. And we're gonna do little boy difficulty because uh, I I haven't played this game before guys. Oh six seconds. Oh, are we starting now? Oh shit. Okay, so this is my house. All right, we've got my daughter here. I love playing the trumpet. We got my stupid kid here. I like drawing. <laughs> and uh, we got a bunch of supplies. Oh no, guys, you hear that? Oh no, the alarms are happening. Oh no, it's the apocalypse. Guys, we gotta grab what we can. We gotta grab what we can. Why am I just talking about it and not grabbing anything? Quickly, grab some water. Grab some poison for some reason so I can kill my family later. Quickly, we need water, guys. We need water. All right, that's how we're gonna survive all this time. All right, dump it in there. I've got a map. I got a flashlight. I got my wife. <laughs> all right, stop my wife in there. Oh no, guys, we're running out of time. We need food. Oh shit, I'm running out of time. Uh. Um, okay. Uh, okay, the end. Okay, I messed up because I didn't use my time wisely. All right, I could save my children, but that would make it even harder because we got to share supplies. So I think soup and water is pretty important. Maybe this uh, board game and this flashlight would be good. We need to plan out what we're going to grab. All right, ready for it? Ready for it? Go, 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 go. Grab the water. Grab everything. Grab, 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 grab. Put it in. All right, more soup. More water. Grab this checkerboard. Gra grab this uh, flashlight. Ah! We're running out of time. We're running out of time. We're running out of time. What about my family? What about my stupid family? Come here, you stupid kid. Get in there. All right, grab this fat girl as well. Oh, my goodness. She wastes three people. Go, 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 go. Quick, quick. Grab the gas mask. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm running out of time. Oh, no. My wife. Where's my wife? My wife. There she is. Grab her. Grab her. Grab her. Grab her. Run! Damn it. God damn it. Okay. Well, uh, I should have just left my wife behind, honestly. The end again. All right. Uh, where is dad gone? I don't know, but he left us a bunch of food and card games and stuff like that. All right. I need to be quicker. Come on. This, <laughs> the 60 seconds is so important. Go, 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 go. Wait, 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 wait. Where am I going? Oh, no. Okay. Go, 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 go. Grab this briefcase for some reason. I don't know. Grab this gun. Oh, the gun's useful. Yeah, the gun's useful. Quickly, grab soup. Soup. Water. Soup and water. Soup and water. Okay, I think this is everything. I think this is everything. I think I've got enough stuff. i got enough stuff. Oh, no, I'm in the wrong room. Oh, great. That was a waste of time. Go in. Ah. Uh, now that was so bad. I didn't grab anything. I barely grabbed any food. Great. Here we go. Day one. Ah. Uh, all right. So we grabbed some soup. Some water, a lot of books and games and stuff like that to keep ourselves bored. A map as well. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Day one, all of us made it into the shelter just a second before the blast. That was a close one. As long as we're all together, we can make it work down here. We remember hearing canned soup is healthy for you. We can't remember bringing those supplies down to the shelter, but we're not complaining. We probably should have stocked it better anyway. Yeah, we probably should have. Hey, look what we found in the suitcase we grabbed upstairs. Good thing we didn't unpack our holiday luggage. Every little thing helps because we are going to run into a lot of problems throughout uh, th this time when we're in the shelter. So every day, I think we have to ration our supplies. <laughs> now, there is a tactic for this. I think I, from what I remember, like some people could survive without water for a few days and without soup. Maybe Maybe the first day I'll give them nothing. Okay, how about that? All right, so that was day one. How uh, how are we looking after day two, guys? Okay, I'm looking a bit rough. God damn it! When the hell are we gonna get out of here? I need a shave. Daddy, what's going on outside? Great, I'm stuck in this stupid bunker with these little shits. Jesus Christ. Okay, so day two we played I Spy and it was pretty fun for the first three minutes. Now we gotta give them supplies. Should I give them some water and soup? We don't have a lot. <laughs> See, look, it goes down. So maybe I should just give everyone. Water. Maybe that's bad though, so maybe I shouldn't. All right, like I said, I don't know how this game works, so I'm gonna give everyone everything. <laughs> this is so bad. No, I shouldn't do that. No, that's bad. Today, I'm just gonna give everyone water. All right, and then I'm gonna give them water again. Uh, I don't know, on day four or day five? I don't know. The contamination of our town is still strong. Scavenging in these conditions could result in radiation sickness. So, should we start preparing for an expedition? I think we should for supplies. I mean, actually, maybe it's still. 
uh, you know, maybe it could result in radiation sickness, so maybe I shouldn't. Nah, nah, screw it, I'll do it anyway. Every new smell attacks our noses in this little shelter, instantly. There isn't much we could miss, so when a single brick fell out from the wall, revealing a tight opening, our senses were immediately invaded by the terrible stench. We should probably check out that hole. Uh, sure, that doesn't seem like anything's gonna go wrong with that. Oh, day three now. Oh, how we doing, guys? Uh, oh. That all seemed fine. We looked into the hole and we found a dead rat. Okay, that was basically it. All right, great. He was trying to break into a can of soup. So now we have a new can of soup. Oh, okay, all right. All right, everything seems fine. All right, so cool. So now we got to ration our supplies again. All right, I'm going to give everyone soup this time. And then I will give everyone stuff, I don't know, on day five. I don't know, guys. So who should go outside? I think we should send uh, Mary Jane, but we don't have anything. Oh, we have a suitcase. Oh, 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 we can take stuff. Okay, we're going to take the suitcase and we're going to take the gas mask. That might be important. We're also going to take a med kit just in case. And we should also maybe take a map. Uh, that seems fine. I'm gonna send my wife to do it. Why not? Oh, there she goes. Day four. Oh, she's gone. All right, and there is nothing on the walls now. Oh, God. I hope she comes back. Otherwise, we've lost all of our stuff. Dolores is on her way to the surface. Let's hope she'll make it back safe and sound. Yeah, we need to hope. All right, everyone seems fine. Cool. So, uh, and we got less people to give supplies to. So, today, everyone's gonna skip. <laughs> the kids miss running around and playing games with each other. <laughs> Should we let them play? What, they wanna play tag? This is a trap. But sure, uh, uh, just don't hurt yourself, kids. Oh, we made it to day five. Who thought we would make it this far? Oh, no, we should have seen it coming, guys. Mary Jane and Timmy ran, ran away too fast. And before we could stop them, they crashed into each other and fell to the ground, causing our supplies to fly in every possible direction. Great. All right, now it's giving me tips. Where is water when Ted needs it? We should get Mary Jane something to drink and we can't leave Timmy for water for too long. Okay, that's our warning, guys. So, uh, I think everyone now can have some water, but we are running low on water, guys. Oh, day six. We're, we're making it, guys. We're making it. Everyone seems fine, honestly. They're not thirsty anymore. That's good. Uh, I'm going to skip everyone today. I might give them soup tomorrow. One of the cupboards in the shelter was a bit shaky, so we pulled it out to give it a new home. In the process, we discovered a secret door. Uh, where does it lead? Uh, no idea, but let's find out. Why is it giving me the option for gun and uh, flashlight? Let's do flashlight. All right, day seven now. We're making progress. We inspected every corner of the room and found nothing. Okay, of course. No one's complaining about being hungry, so I'm going to skip food today. I might give them food tomorrow, though. Day eight. Is everyone still alive? Um, oh, oh no. Okay, <laughs> my daughter looks like she's had enough. <laughs> All right, problem solved. We fixed the leak. That's good. Uh, so everyone's thirsty, so I'll give them water again, I guess. We heard something about supply drops on the radio. This just might be what we need to survive. Shall we go out and find out what is really happening? Well, uh, I can't because I gave the gas mask to my stupid wife. Which, by the way, she's still out there. Guys, I don't think she's coming back. It's day nine and she isn't back yet. Uh, it was too dangerous to go outside, so we decided to stay indoors. God damn it. We shouldn't have sent my wife out that early. We should have sent my wife out now. Okay, everyone's hungry now, so I'll give everyone soup. Mary Jane didn't utter a single word today. This is very odd. Maybe someone should find out what is going on with her. I mean, <laughs> why would I say no to that? She's, go she's going insane, guys. Of course. She's been nine days in this shelter. She's going crazy. All right, day 10. All right. We've made it to 10 days, guys. Oh, no. <laughs> We've opened the soup. I think we're getting bored of eating soup, guys. So, nothing new. Uh, no one's going to eat anything today. And nothing really happened uh, in the book. Okay, so day 10 was just a normal day. <gasps> oh, I heard the door open. Is that my wife? Oh, my wife's back. Hey, guys. <coughs> How's everyone doing? <coughs> my mask broke, but I'm, I'm still alive. <coughs> Jeez, we were glad to see Dolores came back safely from the wasteland. Okay, she brought back everything except for the gas mask. Oh, so we found two waters and we lost our gas mask. So my wife needs to eat and everyone uh, needs some water. The contamination's still strong. We can do an expedition tomorrow, but I don't think we should. I think maybe we should just skip out on this one and then wait for the next one. A phone booth is on our street and it seems to be ringing right now. Should we send someone to answer it? All right, we're gonna send uh, me. Oh my goodness, this is probably gonna be bad. Uh, oh, I seem to be fine. 
Um, let's see what's happened. When we answered the phone, we could clearly hear a gasp of relief. Uh-oh. They introduced themselves as survivors from a nearby town of Hill Valley. We started exchanging information, but the call was cut short. God damn it. Ah, they're giving me the expedition. Okay, I'm gonna do the expedition. Why not? Why not? Okay, so this basically says that they think the government is gonna come help us. Why would the government come help you, alright? The whole world has gone to shit. Let's listen to the radio in case there's an information from the government. We're on day 13 now. How are we surviving this long, guys? I don't even know. We made contact. The military is out there and they're coming for us. All we need to do now is wait patiently. The soldier with the boring voice was very specific about this. Help is on the way. We just need to wait for further instructions and keep our radio in working order. Okay, cool. So I think my wife is still hungry for some reason. I've given up food for like three days straight, but she did but come from like the wasteland, so she must be starving. All right, who's gonna go on the expedition? Uh, maybe I should send my daughter, and I can only send one thing with her. Actually, no, I can send her a bunch of stuff. Uh, let's do the map. Let's do the first aid kit. And let's do, I don't know, a gun. We'll give her some water. Uh, good luck, daughter. Okay, she's gone. Is she gonna be okay, Dad? I don't know. Why didn't you go instead of her? I don't know, kid. Just shut the hell up. Okay, uh, I think I need water and food, and so does my son. My wife can hold on, hold off for today since I've been giving her a lot of shit recently. Wait, guys, you hear that? All right, it sounds like a herd of animals are stampeding just above our heads across what we used to be our beautiful lawn. <gasps> oh, okay. It might be an opportunity to get some fresh food. Okay. I'm gonna go take the gun with you. Day 15. Uh, did we get anything? Oh, every shot we fired to the animals was a miss. Okay. So let's listen to the radio again. Uh, maybe we might hear something. <gasps> I hear that. Did you guys, did you guys hear that knocking? Huh? Huh? Who's that? Dad, someone's at the door. We were able to get a weak signal and tap into the government's emergency announce service. And guess what? Great news. The fallout outside has almost gone. It should be be much safer to travel now. Okay, that's cool, cool. A group of doctors knocked on our door today requesting some supplies. So they want some water from us. So, uh, okay, I'll give you some water. Maybe, wait, was that our last water? Day 17? <laughs> Where's the time gone? Look at me now. God damn it. How long have we been in here, guys? All right, we gave them water and uh, uh, great. I think that's that was our last water. Oh no, we, we have literally no water left, guys. So you can get water and my wife can get soup and my son can get water. Okay, all right, this is we're not gonna last any longer guys. We're pretty sure there's a small group of survivors nearby Mostly old folks from the retirement home <laughs> We need to borrow some of their supplies. Yeah, let's do it. Oh my goodness. What is that? Uh, we had to do this for the family. It had to be done. We really don't want to mention it again But how about we talk about something else a soup perhaps? Oh, no, what did we do to these old people? All right Well, at least we have fixed the water situation. So that's good. We've got lots of water now Oh, she's back and she made it alive in one piece. Look at her. She's fine. Oh, no, the med kit isn't fine though So she came back with the suitcase and the map and, uh, but she lost the, 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 uh, first aid kit. Great. Some additional supplies would have been great, but we didn't get any from this expedition. I knew I should have waited. All right, you stupid daughter. All right, just go eat something, you fat bitch. Should we do an expedition? Oh, no, guys. All right, is it even worth doing? All right, maybe we should just wait. It's really weird when you get the feeling that something is watching you. Our shelter is tiny, but this has been bugging us for a while. We checked all the closets and no one's hiding in there. Is there something alive down here besides us? Maybe a rodent of some kind? Okay, all right, just take the gun, figure it out. Oh, oh, guys, uh, what was that? Whatever it was, it's dead now, quite dead. Maybe there's more hiding somewhere in those nasty little holes? What was it, a rat or something? What was it? So who's gonna go outside? Should I send Ted? Okay, I'm gonna send Ted, okay, screw it. All right, the dad is finally doing his job. All right, he has to get something. Oh, there he goes, Ted is gone, 22 days. Oh my goodness, how are we gonna survive? I don't know. Uh-oh, guys, we are running out of soup. We only have one can of soup left. Oh, what's that noise? What's that noise, guys? Huh? Is that the radio? Oh, God, we're looking scruffy. Oh, no. This guy needs a haircut. Everyone can have a little bit of water today because we need to survive. <laughs> we don't have any soup left. Oh, the military is transmitting again, though. They said the first step is to locate any remaining survivors. Why do we have to do that? A plane will be doing a sweep over our neighborhood this evening. <gasps> okay, so go go, go, take a, go get a flashlight to sig sig signal them. That makes sense. Day 24. Oh, my goodness. Did we, did we do it then? We're pretty sure the pilot pilots saw us. Let's see if they get back to us. Oh, no. Okay, guys. I, how many days do I have to survive down here? Till the... What? Am I, am I rel 
relying on the government to save me now. The other day, we heard a quiet knock on our door. But when we opened, we only found a suitcase on the doorstep. And there was no one around. It is signed, but it was sure looks like it was meant for us. Should we check what's inside? Um, yes? Why would there be a no? I really hope that's something I don't have to regret. Oh, no. Uh, come on now. What's the worst that could happen from opening? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Inside the suitcase, we found some soup, but it expired a long time ago. Oh, the first aid kit. We gave it to Ted. No, come on, Ted. Come back. Oh, wait, no. We didn't give it to Ted. We we, we ruined it. Uh, My kids are hungry. Oh, no. We have one sliver of soup. We found a first aid kit. Okay, great. So, I can finally give my wife the first aid kit and she can now survive. Great. Oh, I heard the door. Is that dad back? Please tell me he bought some soup. <laughs> hey, guys. I'm back. I bought some soup. Yes, Ted is back. Hallelujah. And he bought three soup and two waters. Hell yeah. Okay, we also got uh, this thing and... Uh, oh, but the gun was damaged. Okay, great. So, should we do another expedition? Uh, I'm gonna send my wife this time and uh, she can take... I don't know what the hell is even good for her right now. The map would be good. There she goes. Day 31. We've made it over a month now. Oh, my goodness. Look at my son. <laughs> oh, my goodness, guys. How are we surviving this long? I have no idea. We are running low on soup, guys. We need medical supplies, and what we have is a bad joke. Time to do something about it. The bug spray is just standing there. Why don't we use it to make drugs? This is an amazing idea. <laughs> no, it's not. It's really not. Mary Jane confronted us. She said it's her birthday, but she doesn't want a gift. Not in this situation. So we need to give her a birthday present. Uh, we're going to give her cards to play with. Uh, even though, like, uh, we've had that all this time. All right, day 34 now. Everything seems okay. She loves the cards. Great. Oh, we were afraid the army wouldn't get back to us, but they eventually did. The next transmission was full of evacuation promises. <gasps> so, are we going to do it? One thing you don't expect is a band of people all dressed in green showing up at your doorstep and claiming they take from the rich and give to the poor. <laughs> That's exactly what happened to us. Should we let those clowns in? Man, if they're the type of people that would steal from the rich, what's stopping them taking what we have? But then again, we barely have anything. Oh my goodness, this is such a big decision. This is a make or break decision right now. I'm gonna say no. Man, we are looking rough. Look at us, guys. Ted is hungry. Well, there you go, Ted. Enjoy our last meal. You are not going to get another one until my wife is back. <gasps> oh my goodness. My wife is back. We were about to give up and come back empty-handed to the shelter when we ran into a church. A sizable group of people were busy praying to the bomb, chanting something about the holy fission. Cultists decided they won't be needing any holy water. We did a bit of miracle work and we, uh, you know, got some water. So, did she not bring any food? She didn't bring any food. What was the point? I have one can of soup left. Okay, okay, all right. Right, fine. We're going to do another expedition. All right. We, we're running low on supplies, guys. We, ju we just need to do it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Oh, no. Uh, guys, <laughs> we're all sick. We're all sick, but we don't have any <laughs> any first aid kits. We're so, we're so screwed, guys. I, I think this is going to end pretty soon. I'm not going to lie. What the shit? <laughs> we're running out of supplies too. Dehydration? How are you getting dehydrated? Of course she is because <laughs> they're sick. Oh, my goodness. Okay. All right, whatever. All right, I'm going to send my son. We've lost 40 days. We're not going to last longer, guys. Oh, the radio. Come on. We need a miracle. Oh, everyone's sick. What do we do? There was another military announcement on the radio. The soldiers are nearby and ordering a single person from each survivor group to meet them and outline the group situation. Uh, okay. Uh, this is a bit odd. We do hope they mean well. It is still pretty much the only thing we can do, though. So, yeah, that's true. I'm going to have to send myself uh, Ted. Go on, Ted. You can do it. We made it to the meeting. The serious-looking soldier asked a few questions, made some notes, and told us they would get back to us. We can only hope we made a good impression. Okay, so, um, yeah, we are not going to survive long. So, uh, yeah, and we're starting to get hungry now. <laughs> and, yeah, we don't have anything. So, um, yeah, um, this is, I think this is the end, guys. Oh, what's that? Oh, I hear knocks. Oh, look. Our sickness is cured. Oh, the people that asked for water in the lab coats earlier, when we gave it to them, they came back today and gave us injections. They fixed our health just when we thought we were going to die. 
they came back and saved us. Oh my goodness. If only there was something we could do like breaking into our neighbor's shelter. We know the lock is broken and we saw her restocking the shelter before the bomb fell. Well, guys, we need to. Okay, we are starving out here. Oh, he's back. <gasps> Soup. Okay, okay. We are now very rich in some supplies, but for some reason, we don't feel very good about it. <laughs> Let's never mention the whole thing again. <laughs> so we got four soup from robbing our neighbors, and we got two soup from the expedition, and uh, we found some water as well on the expedition. Okay, that is great. And <gasps> an axe, but we lost the, the suitcase and the book. Uh, okay, cool. Um, so that, that, I mean, that's fine. And the map we lost. Uh, okay, great. Day 49. Oh my lord. Okay, yeah, we are looking pretty rough. I'm gonna send my daughter to go outside. Why not? But we can only take one thing. So, uh, I'll give her an axe. So she might survive. I don't know, guys. The big 50. Uh... When is this government going to come? Day 60, maybe? I don't know. Oh, 60 seconds. That makes sense. We were interrupted by rapid knocking at the door. We found out it was a group of refugees who survived the blast just like we did. They were doing much worse than us and begged us to provide them with any... Uh, we can't. We can't. We can't. We can't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I need to survive to day 60. Okay, look. We're coughing. We're getting sick. Okay. I don't think we're going to last that longer, guys. All right. Those guests left us. Okay. Great. Oh, my goodness, guys. We're not going to survive. Someone's at the door. We cannot hear what they're saying, but they have been banging on it like crazy. Maybe it's good news. Oh, my goodness. I don't know. I don't know. This is probably a mistake. It's probably a mistake. It, ah, uh, ah, uh, I don't know. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't risk it. I can't risk it. Last time we went on a supply run, we noticed a damaged tank stuck in the rubble. Should we send someone to investigate? Let's send my dumb ass son. Actually, no, less than me because I'm sick. Okay, my daughter came back at least. So she found some ammunition. She brought back the axe. That's great. So she brought back some water and some soup. Okay, that's good. Also some bug spray and also a suitcase we now have. Okay, great. Okay, we heard someone at the door. When we opened it, we encountered a strange looking man in a blue jumpsuit who asked us to trade him a water chip. Um, sure. Uh, we have lots of water. Oh, oh no, who's sneezing? Oh no, someone's sick. Day 60. Oh, guys, I don't think it's happening. I don't think we're getting rescued on day 60. I think we got to keep going. Someone's at the door. Ah, oh, fine, just check it out. I don't know. Don't make me regret it. <gasps> no way. No way. Oh, is this the military? Is this the military? We made it. We got rescued by our brave military. We honestly shed tears of joy when those handsome uniforms covered with radioactive goo. <laughs> Let's hope this is the end of our desperate survival and we can finally have a fresh start. Oh my goodness, we did it. We survived 65 days. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. I, I actually didn't think I'll be able to do it. We survived. We survived. Holy crap, guys. Okay, so that was 60 seconds. That was pretty fun. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, we uh, had, a, it was it was pretty hard, but everyone survived, honestly. We didn't kill anyone. Okay, guys, I hope you did enjoy 60 seconds. Uh, pretty cool game. And honestly, I was trying to aim to survive, but there is some really cool, crazy things that can happen in this game if you do certain things. So if you do want me to make another video trying to do other things in 60 seconds, this game has a lot of stuff you can do in it. Uh, leave a like, okay? 10,000 likes, I'll make another video on this game. Either way though, I'll thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video, man. See you later, guys. Bye.